Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 285 sixtieths to 285 sixty-fifths. The diameter difference between these tire sizes is 3.4%, exceeding the acceptable 3% range. Therefore, the interchange is not recommended. If you still want to switch, it will necessitate adaptations to prevent issues such as rubbing or clearance problems. The increase in diameter by 1.12 inches of the 285 65ths will raise the vehicle's ground clearance. This enhancement is beneficial for off-road driving and navigating rough terrain, though it could slightly lower the speedometer reading. Both tire sizes share the same width of 11.22 inches, ensuring that the contact patch remains unchanged. This consistency maintains the traction and stability characteristics of the vehicle. Switching to 285 65ths increases the sidewall height by 0.56 inches. The larger sidewall height enhances impact absorption, offering a more comfortable ride, especially on rough terrains. With the larger 285 65ths tires, the speedometer will read slightly lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 mph, the actual speed will be 20.67 mph. Based on our observation, switching from 285 sixtieths to 285 sixty-fifths can provide noticeable benefits for off-road performance, including increased ground clearance and better impact absorption. However, the difference in diameter exceeds the recommended range, necessitating modifications to avoid clearance issues. On road, the changes may slightly affect speedometer accuracy and fuel efficiency. For those prioritizing off-road adventures, the switch offers valuable advantages, but on-road drivers might find the benefits less significant.